and the session moves on. Picking up the pace from where it stopped the previous day, the session began with a topical thought on backsliding. Stressing on the probable cause of this deceit, Southern Asia Pacific Division Sabbath School and Personal Ministry Department Head Pastor Hermogenes Villanueva reiterates that the choice of people to be with, places to stay, and passion to observe are vital points that one should consider to avoid backsliding. So number one, spending time with wrong people. Number two, spending time in wrong places. Number three, developing wrong passion. God says, I have somewhat against thee because thou hast left thy first love. As the session progresses, certain issues arises pertaining to the screening of assigned speakers during divine service in our local churches. Many have raised their concerns regarding the procedures and policies to observe in organizing invitations, particularly with speakers with questionable credentials. Local missions and conferences were given jurisdiction to look over this matter to protect the integrity and solemnity of every church pulpit. Adventist missions and conferences highlighted their respective progress reports as they exhibit their video presentations during the session. In a special ceremony, the publishing department launched a book of the year entitled Health and Wellness. Church leaders within the Union Territory dedicated the books praying that this will create miracles in the hearts of the readers. During the midday devotional, Central Luzon Conference Executive Secretary, Pastor Israel Bakdayan, admonishes to the delegates the characteristics a true Christian believer exemplifies before the outpouring of the Holy Spirit. Every day, we need to pray for the outpouring of the lottery. Seek for it, pray for it, believe for it. We must have it in heaven is waiting to bestow it. Naghihintay ang kalangitan upang ipagkaloob ang kanyang kapangyarihan, mga kapatid. The year and annual meeting is nearing to its close, but the challenges and the ministry welcomes every worker early for next year. Everyone is in high hopes, looking forward to a fruitful and meaningful service. This is Edward Rodriguez reporting for Hope Today. Oh,